A McDonald's customer, well, <laughs> this happens quite often. Oh. A McDonald's customer's in jail and looking at a long time behind bars after he fired his shot at another customer in a fit of rage that started when a drive through employee forgot one of his sauces. Ooh. Oh, man. When he got the 10 chicken nuggets oh, and only the one and sauce only the pack. One. Yeah, you got to have two. Yeah. Cops say 48 year old Wesley Lee Bullock visited a Tampa area Mickey D's and ordered food. When he noticed his request for the sauce was not in the bag, he lost his ever-loving mind and started shouting at employees through the window. Uh, Justin Garlitis was inside the restaurant waiting for his food, and he stepped in to defend the employees. That's when the bullet got angrier. Uh, Justin then went outside to try and calm him down, but Bullock began punching and choking him. Uh, Garlitis broke free from him and tried to flee in his car, but Bullock got into his car and followed him to a nearby gas station. Uh, where he exited the vehicle and pointed a handgun at the younger man's forehead. He then pulled the trigger, but the gun fortunately jammed and didn't fire. The two then wrestled during the chaos. The gun fired and shot Garlitis uh, Garl in the finger. Uh, Bullock fled the scene but was arrested the next day. He's charged with aggravated assault with a firearm, armed burglary, all over a McDonald's sauce packet. Oh my gosh. He must have ordered the unhappy meal. <laughs> Something. Somebody's wound a little tight. Seriously. A man was arrested in Santa Monica, California for reportedly grilling meat using a shopping cart, a sword, and Bud Light. <laughs> he was caught on camera appearing to use the sword as a skewer. Oh. Inside the cart was wood where he had built a fire. Reportedly, he would occasionally use beer to fuel the flames. Well, you know. He's facing misdemeanor charges for theft for taking the shopping cart, reckless burning, and resisting arrest. Must have been the same guy who got upset at Mickey D's. He's like, I'll, just, I'll have my own barbecue. That's a skewer. And a man who allegedly uh, was armed with a pickaxe is behind bars after a barricade situation finally ended at a home in North Las Vegas. Police say the 51-year-old knucklehead got into a fight with a neighbor and at some point grabbed the pickaxe and threatened him. Who's got a pickaxe laying around? <laughs> Where'd the sword come from? I don't know. I'm prospecting for gold. Seriously. And those are your knuckleheads. Find those stories wherever you follow us on social media. Search Mel and Scott in the Morning. Are we shopping at the wrong places? People like seem to have swords a lot. You ever notice that, do. Knuckleheads? Yeah. Where did they get them? Flea Market, I guess. It's the only place I've ever seen them. I, I if you're a samurai, you better head out to Flea Masters. Oh Just saying. If you're a <laughs> Local Flea Market. All right. Find those uh, stories wherever you follow us on the social medias. Just look Mel and Scott in the Morning. All right.